two big unsolved puzzles of materialist reduction of the mind are intentionality, or the ability of the mind to be about things, and qualia, or the first person subjective look and feel of things. In this video we'll look at qualia and how it presents an apparent problem for materialist reduction. Consider heat in two respects. There are the physical facts involving energy and thermodynamics versus the raw feel of heat, what it feels like to touch something hot. There are several reasons to think that this subjective first-person experience is not explicable in physical terms, and a few arguments will help to illustrate this. Consider Mary, the neuroscientist of the future. She grows up in a black and white room, with no mirrors, perhaps makeup on her skin to keep from seeing the color of her own skin. In short, she is kept from seeing color of any kind her entire life. Yet she is a very smart neuroscientist who investigates and learns everything there is to know about human color perception. She learns about the wavelengths of color, she learns about the human eye, retina, light cones, and so on. She learns about the brain and the brain activity that occurs when color perception happens. And she learns about the neurons involved in color perception. She learns every physical fact there is to know about color perception. But she can't see any color herself. How could she? She's in a black and white room. But now, she leaves the room. And for the first time, she sees a red apple. She sees what red actually looks like. And so the argument goes, she learns something new that she couldn't know from all the physical facts alone. So therefore, the subjective look of the color red is something over and above the physical facts. Another argument is to consider the logical possibility of zombies, creatures that are physically identical to us. They scream in pain when they are burned, they proclaim how good the cake tastes, and so on, and yet they have no first-person subjective experience. Everything inside is dark. Since it appears that all the physical facts could logically be the same about zombies, and yet they do not experience qualia, then qualia must be something over and above the physical facts. And there are even more foundational reasons for the at least apparent impossibility of explaining qualia in material terms. The physical sciences are interested in ignoring the private look and feel of things, and getting to the objective third-person reality. To explain lightning, physical science strips away the subjective experience of the thing to be explained, and explains it in terms of the underlying physical objective reality. But when it comes time to explain not lightning, but the way lightning looks, or the qualia, science strips away the subjective appearance, but in this case it is removing the very thing to be explained, and thus not explaining it at all. Furthermore, the raw look and feel of things is not present in physical matter and energy. The way red looks is not actually present in the light wave itself. So if matter and energy are devoid of qualia, but our minds are full of it, then our minds are not material. So qualia, along with intentionality, remains a challenge to materialist reduction. Some think that this is an in-principle problem with materialism, and others believe that eventually we will be able to get a handle on it and wrap it into the materialist worldview.